so welcome to KO tutorials so let's continue with the next part of this tutorial so we'll be finalizing this part so we have almost done with the lighting over here for this interior coach of Vande Bharat over here so let's render and see how it looks like over here let's render it take a bit of time So what I'll be doing over here is like, I'll just go into this. We can add some light passes. So let's go into rendering. Let's go into render setup. And let's go into render elements. <coughs> I can add some light passes over here. So let's add it, click on add, and let's add the first pass, that's a diffuse filter pass. Let's add global illumination, lighting, <coughs> then we have V-ray reflection, refraction, self-illumination, shadows, specular, V-depth. So these are the light passes which we will be adding and if we have V-ray ambient occlusion, I can even add a V-ray AO pass. So I have already rendered the AO pass, if you want to render it separately we can do that let me check if it is available in this we can just render that okay so once it is done let's go into the render settings and let's just check out the render settings once again over here can just check out the image filter is okay we can slightly increase the uh, minimum subdivisions to 3 by 50. It's going to take time if you render it. Color mapping, I'll keep it as exponential. Activate the sub pixel mapping. GI, I'll keep the primary as iridance map. Secondary as light cache. Iridance map okay looks better okay so once this uh, most of the settings if you want you can change this as well now let's go into the material editor and I can let's go into the material editor press M So I'll go down and I can slightly increase its <coughs> subdivisions, aluminium, we can slightly increase the 
subdivisions of it. <coughs> so I can just click on the subdivisions. So we will just go into this and increase it. Let's keep on adding it. Now, what I can do over here is like, let's render it once again. So as you can see we have added the light passes over here. So we need to render and see it how it looks like over here. It's going to take time. So, guys, if any doubts, please put it in the comment section over here. It's going to take a lot of time to render. So, I'll put the rendered output. So, please like and subscribe my YouTube channel if you are not subscribed yet. So thanks for watching this tutorial.